I'm going to talk about the Swift workstation. I'm going to introduce it to you guys. We'll go through some of the capacities and things along those lines, introduce you guys to the case that we're basically going to be investigating. Then what we're going to do post that is let you guys basically start getting hands-on practice using it. It's been custom built, it's been put together. We actually have a whole team of developers behind the scenes, making sure that everything works correctly and it's free. And, you know, when you actually look at the capabilities of the tool, it's not pretty. Let's be quite blunt about it. You're using Linux, you're using a lot of open source tools, the majority of which are command line. If you want flashy GUIs and you want easy button pushing forensics, then Sift is not the tool for you. Please copy that off so that you can play the quiz and have a go at the latest stage. The instructions of how to start and how to do it is very straightforward. You should be able to do it really. Everything that you need is there, the URL and the pin number. Keep the enrollment code that I posted as well. You do need that. And when you are completing the last pieces of the lab, including the survey and obtaining the certificate of completion or when you want to claim the CPE. So enrollment code is needed, so take that as well. The other piece of information I've posted is for those of you who would like to join this class again, maybe you want to do it again. Maybe you have colleagues that would not attend and tell them that we actually run this regularly. So I've posted the link of how to reach the URL. You can also just Google Cisco Threat Hunting Workshop and you should be able to land on a page where there's a lot of language, there's a lot of countries listed, and then you can just follow the one that you want and register for the next class. We run this every Tuesday until the end of this month, but we will continue obviously July and onwards until next year.